Hey guys, this is Tiffany with the Nerdettes again, and I'm back with another comic haul. Check this box out. It's Wolverine. You can kind of see the comics through the slashes there. These are a combination of comics from a local, they're, they're, it's like a discount store for like media, like comics and um, games, movies, anything you can imagine. So I'm going to show you some books that I got and then we'll get into the comics. So the first book I got was I Love Me Some Anime, of course. So got some Spirited Away. This is number one of that, of course. Then got some Ancient Manga Sprite, number one. Gotta pick up some manga. Gotta pick it up. Come on now. This is Castlevania, number one. Check that out. Have you ever played the game? Cool to have the manga too. This is Return the Labyrinth, which I was never expecting to find or see, and there it was, number one. Pretty epic. Happy to have it. <laughs> My girlfriend is a T Rex. It just sounded hilarious, so I had to get it. That was number one. My girlfriend is a T Rex, number two. I figured since they were both there, why not get both? Then I had to pick up. Now, I love this author. He's written some amazing stuff, so I picked up uh, Heroes of the Valley by Jonathan Stroud. Gotta love it. Okay, so those are the books I got. Er, sorry to jostle the uh, camera a little bit, but yeah. Okay. Oh no. Are you ready? Are you ready? I'm so excited. Okay, so yes, I'm five years old. I got Mighty Morphin Power Rangers Pink. Totally did. Huge Mighty Morphin Power Rangers fan. Although it was funny, I tried to watch it back on Netflix when they had it, and I was like, what was I watching? But yeah, that's what happens. This is Mighty Morphin Power Rangers, the 25th anniversary special, number one. Now, I should mention, I got all of these around a dollar, if not under a dollar, for the record. So, even though it appears like a lot, keep that in mind. This is Mighty Morphin Power Rangers, number two, Megazord. Check that out. Amazing. Okay, then, this is like two cents or a nickel or something. Picked it up. Gotta love some spawn. Why not? Especially if that cheap. This is also a nickel, and it has my lady on it. This is Evil Ernie Revenge, and it has my lady, Lady Death down there. So I had to get it. Then we have Iron Man Legacy. Really cheap. This is number one. Figured why not. This is uh, the Uncanny X-Men uh, part one of Executioner Song. And uh, had to get it. It was really cheap too. This is Dark Wolverine. I think number 79. It was random but it looked really cool so I grabbed it. I do that. Then I got Catwoman number three. <laughs> Look at the Joker down there. That's so funny. Catwoman. Now this was an online one. Catwoman and Wildcat. There's that. And this was also online. The Catwoman magazine. This is number 32. This is the uh, uh, I think this is the Bombshells variant. Yeah, Bombshells variant. Gotta love that. Love that outfit. Uh, then this. Sandman Presents. I don't know how to say that. It looks like Vast. But I feel like I'm saying that wrong. Hmm. But it's Sandman. Gotta love it. Oh yeah. And I was really excited. I'm sure this is probably silly, but I really was excited to see it. This is the mask, the hunt for Green October. Number one. I know. Again, I'm like five years old. This is the mask strikes back, number one. I mean, look at that face. Look at this face. I mean, come on. 
it's a it's hilarious you have to get it oh and then I have a lot of Doctor Who I've got to have some Doctor Who love whenever I see this I try to grab it because I know a lot of people missed out on this the uh, free comic book day Doctor Who the three doctors three amazing new stories of course I had to pick it up it's Doctor Who <clears throat> then I got the four doctors this is part one of five I've never really heard of that, but I was excited to see it there. Then there's the Four Doctors Part 2 of 5. And then, is this sticking? It is sticking. Okay. This is, now he was my favorite doctor for a long time. This is a Pert Wee, which is the third doctor of Doctor Who. This is number one of his. You gotta love Pert Wee. Even, you know, being a Doctor Who fan, a uh, Whovian, as I am, gotta love Pertwee, even now. This is number two of Pertwee. I guess with Joe, right? Yeah. <clears throat> then, we have Doctor Who Classics with the fourth Doctor. This is number one of that. Check it out. Tom Baker for the win. Looks like some tanks down there. This is also Tom Baker. This is number two with, of the Doctor Who classics. There he is with a sword, no less. That is a freaky looking monster. Then we have Doctor Who with uh, Tom Baker again. This is number one. Again. Oh my gosh. Is that a Centaurin? Huh. How cool is that? Then we have David Tennant. Uh, the Tenth Doctor. This is his third comic. I try to pick up ones I don't have. And uh, it serves me well. This is uh, Matt Smith. And it looks like the War Doctor. This is number one. There you go. And yes, anything with him and River Song on it, I am there. This is Doctor Who with the 11th Doctor, number 7. And there she is. Gotta love Alex Kingston. River Song. Amazing. This is number 8 with them. Gotta love that. Okay, here we go. This is Capaldi's uh, 12th Doctor. This is number 2. Look at that. Pretty epic. <clears throat> okay. <laughs> Completely random. Bill and Ted Save the Universe, number one of five. I love some Bill and Ted. I do. And so, of course, I had to get this. Okay. This is Tarzan Carson of Venus, number one. Uh, this was like a nickel. So, I had to pick it up. I mean, Tarzan. My man pretty awesome. I just love this art. This is uh, Spider-Woman number six by Michael ben Bendis. Look at that. Also, it looks like body paint. It really does look like body paint. I mean, I wouldn't be... I'm just saying, that's amazing. Uh, in that same vein, this is also Spider-Woman number seven. It really does. I mean, look at that. It has to be. It is amazing though. That is fantastic. Okay, then we have Vamps Pumpkin Time. And this is random, but I had to pick it up. I mean, just look at that. And it was, it was only like 10 cents or something, I think. Pretty crazy. This is The Land That Time Forgot, number one. Gotta love that. Looks pretty cool, so I picked it up. Y'all know I love me some Evangeline. This is Evangeline number three. Of course, I saw that and had to grab it. Look at that. Amazing. And, of course, my lady, Lady Death. Ooh, fine. Before I drop it. This is, I don't know what number this is, but it's amazing. Look at it. Like, got some puppet strings on her. Epic. Then, something I've never read but looked interesting. It's called Nightside number one. 
figured I'd check it out. Especially at like a nickel or whatever it was. Really cheap. Stupid cheap. I mean, come on now. Uh, Savage Red Sonia, Queen of the Frozen Waste, number two. Check it out. Uh, Savage Red Sonia, Queen of the Frozen Lace, number three. And then we have, <coughs> excuse me, uh, Medieval Spawn and Witchblade, number one. Now, this is a cover I do not have of it, so I had to get it. Look at that. It's amazing. Okay, next we have Danger Girl, Kamikaze. This is uh, the number two of it, but yeah, it's Danger Girl, which, uh, if I'm not mistaken, is J. Scott Campbell. Let me look for his, surely his signature. Oh, is that it? Hiding? Maybe? I don't know. But there you go. Then we have Angela, uh, and just the Mabs, though. I know you can't really see it, but yeah, the Mabs, though. Jeez Louise. Epic. Oh, God, this. I was stunned to find this. This is Glory and Angela number one. Absolutely stunned to find this at a nickel. Look at this. Glory and Angela. <sighs> Just saying. Okay, I love me some Street Fighter. This is Street Fighter Legend Ibuki number two. Had to pick it up. Gotta love some Street Fighter. I used to play that all the time. Here we go again with Street Fighter. This is Street Fighter versus Darkstalkers, and uh, I really would love more of the series. This is number one of it. Check that out. <sighs> amazing. Just amazing. So excited. Okay. And then my girl Vampirella. This is Vengeance of Vampirella number 13. She's back in the back there as you can see. And then, oh god, this one. This is Aliens and Vampirella number 1. What? Aliens and Vampirella? Like, for real though? Look at it. I had no idea this existed. I'm a bad comic fan. Look at this. What? What? Aliens and Vampirella number two. What? Look at this. Eh. I just, I can't. Okay, Aliens and Vampirella number five. I know it's out of order, but that's what they had. I grabbed all of what they had. And I'll try to fill in the collection later. But yeah. Who, who knew? Not me. Mm -hmm. Okay, this I got offline. This is Marvel, uh, The Amazing Spider-Man. Number 800, this is a Midtown Comics exclusive variant. And it's huge. Look at that. That is a badass cover. So, of course, I had to get it. Uh, <laughs> if you saw my last uh, haul, you'll, you'll recognize this one. Unnatural uh, number one. I'll be giving away one of these in my uh, comic haul giveaway. And because uh, whoever get, wins deserves a good comic to read. <clears throat> okay, then I got Gen 13. I just happened to come across the uh, number one of it. And uh, I think that's number one. Look at it. Look, Gen 13. Of course I grabbed it. Okay, this is another uh, J. Scott Campbell cover. This is kind of like a, it's like a tattoo. It's a wraparound, so I'm going to take it out kind of gently so you can see it. I don't want to bend it or anything, so I'm just going to take that out. There's that side with Mary Jane, and that side. That's the back. Pretty epic. Excited to have that in my collection. Gonna put that back in the mylar. Can't have that getting bent. 
Okay then. Still going. Almost done. The Mighty Thor. Uh, number 705. This is the Art Germ variant, of course. I've been meaning to get it. Haven't yet, but I finally grabbed it. <clears throat> this is also an Art Germ variant. This is Wonder Woman number 51. Let's see. Art Germ cover. <coughs> I'm going to have a lot of these. I got I got a free one by accident from online of uh, the Life of Captain Marvel number one. So yeah, uh, yet another one that'll be going in the uh, giveaway. And last but not least we have uh, Batman number 49. Hi! I'm back. Okay, and last but not least. Catwoman number one. Catwoman number two. And that's actually not all. And hold on one second. I got stay there. Don't leave. You can test it for all the covers with Art Germ. So this is the first one. Amazing. The second one. Look at it is the human torch. Yay! And last but not least, Invisible Girl. Hot. Look at that. It's gorgeous. I'm so stoked. This is probably one of my favorite covers of his. Oh, and last but not least, Unnatural number two, the Art Germ variant. So, yeah, that's it. I promise. That's all. Uh, a lot of those, like I said, were the discount store. A lot of those are online orders. Just a, just a collection. And this is my Wolverine box. So yeah, if you haven't already, subscribe to the YouTube. Like us on Facebook at facebook.com slash And I really appreciate you guys watching. We'll see you later. Bye. Bye-bye.